Okay, it's time to assemble the cabinet boxes. Uh, in an effort to save a little bit of plywood because the stuff's not cheap, we're gonna use uh, three vertical supports. So one on each side and one in the middle versus building two separate boxes and then attaching them together. This will be two boxes that are really, I'm saving one piece of vertical support per box that I build. Saves a little bit of, uh, a little bit of plywood. Cabbage drawer box put together.
Well, we're wrapping up the lower section of the cabinets on this side of the shop. The drawers are pretty shallow, and they're that way because I don't want to end up stacking a lot of stuff on, on top of items that are in the drawers. I want to make everything kind of just there in the drawers, and that's why there's so many. Time consuming to build this many drawers, but the finality of them is really something I was looking forward to to make the shop a lot more user friendly. Uh, the large workbench is going to be extremely nice to have. We'll eventually get some upper cabinets and some lights over here, so that'll be just really nice setup. Some wall storage, which check that video out when it comes out shortly. Tabletop was just two by sixes, and it'll be easy to sand and refinish as I dent and damage it because it's not. It's not a permanent countertop, right? This is a sacrificial surface that will get damaged and beat up over time, and I'll just replace it. But right now, uh, it's gonna serve me really well for how I wanna use my shop. I hope this uh, has given you some ideas on what you would like to do in your shop potentially. So until next time, thanks for watching.